Anyway, can you make some coffee? No, you can hold this, but you can always share mine. Anyway, I've got you something here. It's good. Ooh. Yeah, it's not open, it's not for you, it's for Mrs. Bell. Mrs. Bell. Okay, Miss Bell. I'm confused. Today, you will go to Miss Bell and give this present as an apology to what you did to Miss Bell. Why would I want to go and do that? There are two reasons. First reason is that you still like this woman a lot. Right? And the second reason? No, 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 I didn't finish the first reason. And in order to feel better about yourself and more secure, you have to go and apologize for her. And the second reason is? I'd like to go and sit there. I like to drink there. I like to watch you watching her, not watching us there. In order to do all of these things there, you have to go and apologize to Miss Bell there. Do you understand? Me? Maybe. So you're gonna go, right? Woo! This is a bad idea. Chris, you'll be perfectly fine. You always come here, you always look at you. Just don't get too physical. Mm. There she is. She is beautiful. I think she needs a nose job, honestly. Right, how do I look? Lose the glasses, keep the glasses. You look very oh, pretty. Yeah, shirt. You should have had the haircut. Yeah, uh, anyway. Shirt, tie. Do it I get some? No, 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 no. Shirt. Don't do anything, it gives you eye attitude. She's what? She's here. Eye attitude. Oh, hi. Oh. Hi, hi, hi. Uh, you look fine, by the way. Thanks. Uh, you're Christopher A. Justin, right? Yeah, that's... Uh, okay, just uh, give me a sec, I'll be back, hold on. Okay. She knows my name. Go talk to her. For England, Chris. Here you go. Where did you get this from? I found a book near the table where you guys usually sit the day you hit me. I recognize you from your picture, so I kept the book with me. I thought I'll give it back to you when I see you. Oh, <laughs> really? Okay. okay. I need a plan. Start by a haircut, Chris. Mm -hmm. No. Hold on. Sorry, sorry, Hannah, I'll what call you back, okay? I'll call you back. Bye. 5.30? 5.30. I've got it! Sorry for that. Once again. Oh. I'm, I'm, I must have completely forgotten about this. You didn't show up for a while, so I began to read it. Chapter 1. The sun was shining through the windows of a couple, a crying child, a carrying the perfect combination of calm and solace. And I couldn't put it down. Sometimes I woke up at night and I continued reading. It seemed so familiar to me, the way you describe things, the way you wrote. Then I finally understood. Their eyes were no longer shy for one another gazing into and forever. The end. For you, the waitress with the pretty eyes, beautiful smile and pink hairband. I remember you from before too. I remember you writing down some notes every now and again. I'm the girl with the pink hairband, aren't I? Aren't I? Is she? I didn't leave 
book there on purpose, you know. I'm glad you did, though. And I also done one small change. I hope you don't mind. It's near the end. Oh, um... <clears throat> uh, this is for you. Thank you. You shouldn't. Just a little something I, I, I put together. I yeah. have to go to work, back to work now, but you know where to find me. No way, man. No way. That was very, uh... Magritte? Magritte? Surreal. Yeah. Surreal? Anyway, I can't believe you wrote the book for her, man. If she had read the book, you'd have known all along. I have read the book, but it was a bit... Magritte. Come on, let's go. She's perfect. She's sweet, kind. My God, Chris, who's the female in this relationship? You or her? Want to get the book published? We're going to go away, sail off into the sunset. <laughs> you don't even know if the book will sell, Chris. Sells just one copy. Mm. It'll be worth it. So anyway, what do you want to do tonight? You're going to go bowling, clubbing, have a drink? dinner or just hang out you know you know why because I was thinking like it's been a while that we didn't go out together and you know spend some match of time together what do you think Chris Chris <laughs> The one what? She's the one. Oh, the one? Yeah. What do I do now, Chris? What, what, what do you do? Labib, you know there are six billion people on this earth. Right. Three billion women and three billion men. Roughly right. Not three billion women like that knocking around now, are there? And then? And then? And then? Go and get it. <laughs> I really quite, I really, sorry, I really, I really like, I should articulate. Anyway, Come let's on. go. I'm the girl with the hairband, aren't I? Is she? <laughs> and cut. Ah, Chris! <laughs>